The Human Development Report for 2019 by United Nations Development Program was launched today in Kampala. The report indicated that income inequalities were going down globally. In Uganda, the inequalities are still evident, with poverty lines growing bigger as the trends shift from northern Uganda to eastern Uganda. The gap between the rich and the poor is still big. Climate change has also been cited as a new threat to human development if not tackled with the urgency it requires. Unfortunately, lately, we have been observing some reversals in some indicators and slow progress in others. These include a rise in income poverty from 19.5% in 2012-2013 to 21.4% in 2016-2017. A shift in poverty concentration from northern to eastern Uganda that climate change will, will have disproportionate impact on the poor, excavating existing inequalities, while technology could affect either way the level of inequalities depending on how we shape its use. This means we must systematically manage the climate crisis. The inequalities have been attributed to a number of factors. The, the, the most economically democratic sector that should have caused growth that should have caused that inclusive growth is really to do something on agriculture. Because 78% of the people are there, but the, the sector is growing at 3.8, industry is growing at 3.5, services is growing at 7.8. All the other agriculture that has almost three quarters of the population is growing at its lowest and contributes about 23% GDP. In other words, in Uganda you are functioning the other way around. The issue that we have to deal with from the planning point of view is to stop thinking that we can address a problem at a time when people grow, have grown. We should be addressing the problem from the day a person is born. Prepare them for the future. I mean, if we have children who are growing with sickness, don't expect them to be better adults. So the investment should start from the day a lady conceives. The report notes that if the inequalities in human development persist and grow, the aspirations of the 2030 Agenda for Sustainable Development will only remain stated on paper with no fulfillment. Olivia Komgisha, NTV Weekend Edition.